Hello, people. We are on the hunt for the cockatrice. Kill it. Kill it. Bye. You missed me, you jerk. Okay. Uh, what you can see in my inventory is my gravitite sword. Um, very neat sword. And when I made it, it gave me an achievement saying, Pink is the new blue. Uh, sure. So this gravitite sword, apparently, I haven't tested it out except for on... Oh my god, he's still hitting me. Or, or trying to hit me. Run, run, run. Can't run anymore. If I had those daggers, I would definitely blow him to pieces. But I wanted to see what these things were. And they're very, very close to my house. You can see my house in the top, top right. Whoop! Okay, so they fire things too, and I don't have any apples on me, so this should be interesting. Can I... Okay. Oh, wow. Ouch! You jerk things! Oh! Oh, I know what these are. Oh, no! Oh, no! Okay, I am a little bit dizzy. Oh, yay! Okay, gotta stay still, somehow. Ouch. Ouch! Oh, it's like pushing me over the edge! Gotta stay still. I need those apples. I need those apples so badly. If I can get to them. Okay. So what those were, they dropped these. And if I were to put them in my book, which they give me a million of. Uh, let's see what it says. Drop by acorn plants. Uh, use to tame and feed moas. So that says it all. Right there. So great. If I find moas, uh, and they give me eggs, and what, what the heck was going on there? So yeah, I don't have my sentry boots anymore, and these guys push me down all the time. Oh, okay, a few things. Before I even show you my house, because there is some spoiler on that house like you wouldn't believe. This is my inventory right now. I don't have much. I'm just in gold armor, my useless blue cape, but it still looks good. And, uh, ooh, did you see it? I don't know if you saw it. No, you don't. <laughs> okay. So, I hope you all enjoyed the live stream that I had the other day. Uh, it is the other day now. I was going to record this the night of, and I did, but I had to redo it. Why? Because it just went on for too long. That's why. So, I hope you all enjoyed the live stream. It was kind of unplanned, and I didn't do what I really wanted to do to, to kind of prepare for it. And to top it all off, there were a whole bunch of crashes that happened, just constantly. Just constant crashing, which I believe was the result of my graphics card. I looked into the problem after, and I had 47,000 error logs created for my NVIDIA card. So, I went out today, I bought a brand new uh, ATI card and I hope that it does things a little bit better. I know that it is more compatible with, say, the shader mod, for example, so I think it's a good thing. Now, one of the things that we talked about in that live stream, a few of us, discussion going on, was that where you fall in the Aether, you always appear over your portal. But that's not true. At least not in this version. This is the 1.9 pre-release version, and Whoa, oh God! Well, we're about to see it. Okay. So, I am nowhere near my portal. I am in the middle of the jungle. At 465 by 542. And my portal is actually at 256 by 222. Now, what is this? Well, I made this. <laughs> I actually landed here so often, because it's right by my home in the Aether, that I decided that I was going to make a portal here so that I don't have to run back 200 blocks in that direction, I think it would be, uh, just to get back there. So I made one here, and sure enough, when I go back through it, instead of taking me to my first portal, it takes me right to my home. But, and here's the big spoiler I was saving you guys from seeing. Look at it! That's not right! No, why did it do that? It spawned it right into my house. It couldn't have spawned it like... Even if it had put it here, I could have moved the door. 
ideally it would be here. And I might actually destroy this portal and kind of recreate it in the overworld just to move it over. Um, but for now, just for convenience, that's kind of okay. So, what else are we going to talk about? Well, I wanted to talk to you guys about uh, a little bit of an initiative I'm going to be doing, but I think I'm going to save that for my dinosaur video. So this video is purely to try and kill those circular plants, which I completely forgot about for a moment. Look at these birds spawning everywhere. And yes, I have Optifine reinstalled with this thing. That's fine. There is a a new version of Optifine out actually, but this is the older version in this jar. Uh, let's see. Uh, where are my apples? There they are. I'll take half. I don't need all of them. Okay, so now that we have our poison anti-venom, anti-poison thing, let's go and gravitate their heads off. Well, do plants have heads? I don't know what they have. But they're coming off. They need to die. Because I want their pink fluffy innards. Okay, so how should I tackle this? Not with a snowball flying in my face. Kill him. Okay, the trick is to kind of jump around them, I guess. And that way their little tiny tendons don't hit you. Oh, can I reach this guy? Ooh, I was going to jump for him. But probably not a good idea. If he comes lower... They seem to stay away from you, though, so... Oh, well. If I find more of those plants, it would be very helpful for when I do actually find a moa. Moas are blue in color, I believe, but they could be just about anywhere. I haven't explored this place to some great extent. I've never found one of those flying pigs, or figs, as they call them in this. And I've never seen a flying cow, either. Um, for all I know, they could be spawning all around me, and I wouldn't know it because I haven't been really traveling. So, I don't know. Okay, back to that initiative I was going to talk about. Um, you'll find out more in my dinosaur video, so you'll definitely have to check that out. But it's going to affect... Um, all I can say in this video so far is that it will affect subscribers to me. Um, not in any bad way, in a very good way. A very, very good way. So, just keep that in mind. And the last thing I want to say in this video, while we kind of look on the horizon for any figs or flying cows or fowls, as they may be called. Is this... what is this? Is this the first dungeon? Oh, this is the first dungeon I ever found. Oh, the memories. Um, as I was saying, as we look for the the fowls and figs of this world. Uh, what will we say? Okay, after several minutes of just sitting here trying to remember what I was going on about before I got totally distracted by that dungeon, uh, I still don't really remember. But what I was talking about was the subscribers, how something good is going to come of uh, the next dinosaur video that I'm going to do. So what I'd like to suggest is if you uh, would like to to see what I mean... <laughs> oh god! Well, I'm about dead. Don't worry, I still got the thought in my head. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. But what I'm going to suggest is even if you don't follow my dinosaur series, you got to check out this video. Oh god! Well, I get to test out the apple. Did it cure me? Oh, yeah. You're dead now. Oh. The gravitate sword makes them float up. Aha. Oh, that's perfect. Oh, he hit himself. Take a... Ha, ha, ha. Your own medicine. Yes. If he kills himself. I just want to see it happen now. Well, he kills himself. If you are not a fan of that series... Oh, look at this guy. I got my eye on him too. You gotta check out that video because it's gonna be very important. And uh, I hope you all enjoyed this episode while I die of poison intake. Come on. While that does that, I'm gonna run up here. Man, that's awfully green. 
It's making like a, a cave noise. But we're definitely not in a cave. It's very dark. But it's not a cave. Die. Oh, man. I can't see him. Where is he? Get him. Oh. The gravitite sword, it makes them fly upwards. I can't do a thing. It's either blue or purple, but I can't see. No. Oh. This is just horrible. This is horrible. Okay, I eventually killed him. And everything is good in the world again. Huh. Okay. That's all we're going to do for this episode. Very quick episode, I know. Um, but basically showing you that when I fall, wherever I am, if I were to fall here... In fact, should we do it? We are far from home in any direction. This will be in the jungle. I am at 302478. I couldn't see if that was a 0 or an 8. So I fall... And we are at far away from where we were before. We're in the snow. And uh, there's a fire over there. Do I see the portal even in the distance? Man, I, I don't know where this biome is at all. I haven't run into snow yet. So we're kind of surrounded by it. I'm figuring that it'll be somewhere in this jungle. So <laughs> until I find my portal... See you all next time. Uh, check out that dinosaur video for more information about that subscriber special special. That's what it is. It'll be a, a 300 subscriber special special initiative event extravaganza. Just watch. Thanks for watching this one. See you next time. Bye-bye.